CMNA yeah, advertising which is part of, agency. Uh, which is part of uh, Baka McCormick, Ogilvy right. and Maitha right. at that time, and still is, I think. How long did you last? I was there for three years, four years. Did you enjoy it? I enjoyed it thoroughly, and we actually, living there, we formed our own ad agency, which only ran for a year, and we couldn't pull it. So that was my first failure. <laughs> <laughs> so the, the, this this was Chamba Goto and Munez. Yes. Talk to me about the experience of uh, putting this threesome together, and 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 uh, for the long time that you drained the lessons that you got from there. Well, it was uh, us thinking that there was a good market for our skills and our connections, and I think were that you friends? The three we're friends. We worked together. Uh -huh. We were actually, it was just, uh, we en masse moved away from uh, CMA, the All three right. of us, and we formed an agency. And um, it, yeah, it's something that when I look back, it was good because we learned some lessons. But the, le the, the bigger lesson is that it doesn't always work to think that if we are working together in an organization, we can go and start our own, the two, because the dynamics are totally different when you are not out there and you co own something. Mm. When you're reporting in an organization, you can actually be bosom buddies, but out there it can, it can be a, a, a challenge. But also I think that the market was turning. Mm -hmm. And I felt, oh no, maybe it was a premature jump. For me, uh, if you prematurely get into something, there are some hard lessons. Mm -hmm. And I think that was one of them. Mm -hmm. uh, that what I, was the hard lesson there? That we were not prepared for what it took to get this whole business going. Mm. We were not prepared. Mm. We were like almost at the takeoff. We thought we are on a runway and taking off. But actually, we were supposed to be thinking we are going to the airport. Mm. What, what was the attraction of the idea? The attraction of the idea was in various ways. Number one mm. was running our own thing. Okay. okay. Those days, it was just, this is my thing. This is my show. I don't need to go and produce something to anybody. That's number one. Number two was the, the belief that we could change the advertising industry at that time. The third thing was that we could make as much money as we could and uh, we could be splashing around and going all over the place and saying, look, hey, we, we're doing well. Mm -hmm. So I think it was a youthful zeal as well mm -hmm. in some way. Mm -hmm. And it failed. I, and it failed. Uh, it failed and uh, it, it failed to the point that I had to go back to formal employment. Mm -hmm. So, so being an entrepreneur. Oh yes, it was a premature jump. Mm. Mm. But I learned that lesson that you need to do it. Mm.